it was taking me back to the video that I listened that I watched this morning with Dave which I thought was so powerful just really 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 super powerful so if you haven't seen it I'd I would really encourage you to watch it's only five minutes uh but it's it's yeah just powerful and emotive really and I could recognize so many I suppose idiosyncrasies that Dave was um referencing you know just the you know not listening just multitasking it was a, the you know your your points about multitasking and how there's always we're, we're tuned in we're half listening to this we're half doing that and you miss so much and and you know you're not in the moment you know and as Dave was saying very wise man you know suddenly he's is rec- it's like meeting his wife for the first time and I and I thought about that for my personal life, but also for work life. I work with people with disabilities, and and uh, you know every day we always say, it, you know, let's listen deeply and truly to the person and really tune in and find out what it is they're telling us and showing us, either in the spoken word or in behaviours and actions. If people don't use words to communicate, and sometimes that can be quite a tough role. And but but we also say, you know, let's start each new day afresh. But that isn't always easy to do, but but sort of taking Dave's comments and his wisdom from from the, from the from his interview, uh, his conversation today that I listened to, I just think it's so much easier when you stop for a moment, put down the rucksack of assumptions and the the rucksack of yesterdays and all those old conversations and all of those assumptions and predictions, really, and just truly think right no. This moment is a new moment. You know, it's not just a new day, it's a new moment. You've got an opportunity to, to truly listen to someone and to learn from that person. So yeah, <laughs> that's kind of, that's what that's what I'm I'm thinking, you know, listen, listening to the conversation this evening, just just how you know precious truly listening to people can be for ourselves, not just not just for the person to be heard, but to almost like bear witness to that. And to to um, to learn something about ourselves and think, yeah, you know, and put down that heavy weight, put down that heavy rucksack of of thinking we we know what's going to happen and we know what that person's going to say, we know what that person's going to feel. It's liberating, really. <laughs> <laughs>